Hi everyone, so in the last video I have showed you how to design this sci-fi template. So in this video I'm going to show how I did all the texture work in the software. So that being said, let's start making this black material, that uh, scratchy material that we did. So for that, first of all we're going to need our regular principal BSDF and that we're going to need some other nodes. So first of all we're going to need uh, just let me screen first so we can just see it all together in a better way. So let me just select my material first. Uh, we're going to add color ramp and adding color ramp after that we're going to need bevel and bevel node we're going to get it. First one is going to be eight segment, second one is going to be four segment. Then we're going to need uh, image texture. Image texture uh, by enabling your node wrangler add on, you have to select the image texture, press control T to adding the mapping node and uh, texture coordinate node. Then select uh, open any roughness map that you have and connect it in the first bevel node value output input. And uh, after that, we're going to need to mix node, set it to the vector and color, and uh, the vector going to be changed to a difference where we're going to connect these two bevel nodes and uh, after that we're going to connect this uh, into a uh, mix shader that we're going to use here the separate XYZ that we're going to use here so separate color select it to the HSB and after that we're going to connect it to So after selecting the uh, color and friends connecting our bevel node, we're going to uh, add separate color node right here. We're going to get result to the color and connect it to the HSB, RGB to HSB. And after that, we're going to connect our value out to the color ramp applicated. Color ramp and we're going to connect this to the B. That's how we're going to add all these branches and scratches to the material. And after that, you can just uh, scroll down those bars and uh, make it the way you like it. You can just use the color ramp to adjust all the scratches and the color that you are and the metallic part for your material and the text. So this is done. Uh, you can try to connect it to the roughness that work like that so you can just connect it to the metallic part and choose the roughness according to you that's how we're going to make these scratches over it and after that we're going to add some variation in the texture just like this brown color so simply just click on one that number so it can be a different material and then you can just change the color of the material uh, you have to just change the color for the color ramp and you can just adjust the material according to you totally up to you Use your creativity to make uh, the different kind of material. Same goes for the downward. We're going to make it uh, full frame. For that, just make it another. Use the drop tool to make that color. And here we go. Have that frame texture. Now you can add some variation in the parts as well. Like I'm going to give it this brown color. And the upper one, I'll give it another brown color. It's right here. So I'm just adjusting the color to make it a bit various and uh, yeah so this is done right now we're going to uh, add the stream color right here that of brown so we have some of the variation in the texture so this material right now we have this material and now we're going to create this hologram material that we seen all over the side right? all over the tablet so i'm just naming it hologram and for that uh, we can name some of so first of all, we are going to add, uh, I'm going to delete my principal BSDF, we don't need it. First of all, I'm going to add a color ramp. Adding the color ramp, I'm going to add a glass BSDF and a emission shader. After adding the emission shader, I'm going to add a image texture and uh, I'm going to use uh, the color output in the color ramp. Sorry, not the glass one. To the color ramp, then we I'm going to use a mix shader right there. 
then uh, glass BST is in the first shader emission shader to the next and we're going to use color ramp as vector and shade it to the side and now I'm going to choose uh, the image that I have used you can use whatever image you want according to your imagination um, that's how you get these right there and you can also do one thing you can just connect the color to the emission to make it the color that you want you can use any other color that you want or you can use the image now if you're going to adjust the color ramp you can have some variation of the broken effect in that and same goes to those buttons like we're going to assign the same hologram material to those and let me select those first of all I'm going to assign or if you can see the um, texture has been assigned to the wrong side so I'm going to assign it to the right side and uh, selecting the number so it can be the one and I'm just assigning to another image for this one and right now you can see we have this button same thing goes for the down one I'm going to write the texture orientation of the texture is select control plus control light on word selection and here you go hologram one right? and that is how you make these buttons and same the variation that I'm going to use is going to be right here so like so simply just select those sign the hologram material to the right side and the black paint material to the other side so it's not that uh, transparent or you can see some variation this is how i just simply cube projected this like uh, selecting those and uv and wrapping to the projection and uh, you can choose it wherever you want and whatever you want just like this app rotating it by selecting it whatever design you like to have you can have that like the same thing goes for this one i'm going to add a screen right here as well so you can just add another material I'm trying to remove all these extra material so just select that hologram material and sign it to the First of all, I'm assigning the black material, and after that, we're going to assign the hologram material. Like so, you have these textures going on. Same 